Crabman here, and today we're going through the story mode of Just Bring It with Billy Gunn. Or as he's known in this game, the one Billy Gunn. And today we're going to be challenging for the Intercontinental Championship. So Vince will always kick you off unless you're already a champ, Billy Gunn. A huge opportunity for you involves you and the tag team titles. Well, I've been tag team champion eight times already, or nine times, or ten times, so no thanks. These are the steps you'll need to follow if you want to challenge for the Intercontinental Championship. So, Billy doesn't want to form a tag team, doesn't want to team with Bart Gunn, doesn't want to team with Chuck, doesn't want to team with Road Dog. Doesn't want a team with the big show, as the Shoguns. What a team. He's just going to stay by himself as the one Billy Gun. Raw entrance, we'll skip that. Weighing 252 pounds from Victoria, Texas, Stone Cold Steve Austin. Here comes Austin with his really, really strange entrance music. I know I could... You can actually go into the Creator Wrestler and choose his um, disturbed music that doesn't have any lyrics. For some reason, this is his default music in the game. Really, really strange. I'm pretty sure he never used this on TV. And he'll call out the champion, which I believe is now the big show from my last playthrough. So on to my third playthrough out of all the characters. Hopefully I can persevere, get them all done. Big Show, you can't hide backstage all night. Yep, Big Show is the champ. It's like it's just been Survivor Series to 1999 all over again. Nearly said 2000. Big Show won the title the WWF title for the first time at Survivor Series 99 and then lost it to Triple H I believe on the first Raw of 2000 so that Triple H could go on to face Cactus Jack at Royal Rumble 2000 in an absolute classic here's Austin obviously Big Show's not going to show up here is going to come Billy Gunn With his one Billy Gun music. Alright, so if you want to challenge for the Intercontinental Championship, you will need to talk smack or talk trash on the mic. Don't stop thinking you're going to get a title shot before Billy Gun. It's my tag team partner who's the WWF champion. Face it, Austin, you're washed up. Love it. No one around here wants to see Stone Cold Steve Austin in a title match? Yeah, absolutely not. Give Billy Gunn a title shot. Yeah, Austin, he's not happy. I think I remember hearing a story from the uh, Something to Wrestle podcast with Bruce Pritchard about Austin not wanting to work a match with Billy Gunn on Raw because it was just a cold match with no story and Austin said well I'm not going to wrestle um, Billy Gunn if there's no story I'm only going to wrestle if there's a if there's a story then you know have a four minute match with Billy Gunn on Raw it's an interesting story all right you need to go have a chat to Michael Cole and which I don't really understand you need to say that you were just messing what you said to Austin no oh, I was just messing and wasting time on Raw I was just messing with the guy. Yeah, he is the guy. Should put the V bit in bold. Because Austin is the guy. Oh, he's a nobody. He's the most influential star in the business, but he's a nobody. Billy Gunn's where it's at. Billy Gunn's still wrestling. I believe he's wrestling in AEW. The commissioner was looking for you. And then you know, need to go to Regal's office. See what's happening. I love if you wander off the wrong way as well. 
and you always end up upstairs, which I find really weird. I don't understand why you wouldn't just end up where you were with Michael Cole, who's now vanished. All right, we can do the really slow turn. All right, and let's go into the commissioner's room. Here's Regal and Tajiri. Should be. Oh, it's just Regal. Do you want a shot at the European title? Well, not really. Hmm. Weird. Go to Regal's office. Hmm. I thought I could have an Intercontinental title shot. Oh well, let's... Let's have a European title shot. Hmm, I wonder what you need to do to get the Intercontinental title shot. Maybe you have to be someone else, I don't know. I thought that was... Federation European title. Interesting. I thought that was the storyline to get the IC belt. Oh well, let's get the European Championship. Probably more on Billy Gunn's level anyway. Billy Gunn versus Matt Hardy. Delete. Matt Hardy, one of my absolute favourites. Here he is, Billy. Yeah, this push didn't really last long for Billy Gunn as the one Billy Gunn. I always liked Billy Gunn, so athletic. He was better in tag teams though. Look at all I've got. You can make a blind man see. Everything you wish you have. God gave it all to me. Like a good tag team partner in the road dog. Here comes Matt. Such a shame they had nothing for him to do in, in WWE, so I'm glad he's gone to AEW so that he can continue. And I'm sure in AEW has more freedom with his gimmick with Broken Matt Hardy. I love the final deletion. Go and watch it again. Gee, always, I'm never ready at the start of these matches. So I think this is it. I just get a, I just get a title shot on Raw, and this might be the whole storyline for for Billy. Come here, Matt. Just introduce the superstars. To be fair, Billy Gunn versus Matt Hardy's probably not a pay-per-view match. Did who did Matt Hardy win the Euro title off? I, was it? I think it was Hurricane. Or did Bradshaw win it off Hurricane? Who did Matt Hardy win it off? I can't remember, I've forgotten. What did he win off Eddie Guerrero? No, you won it off Eddie. I'm sure you won it off Eddie Guerrero. Um, post down in the bottom if I'm wrong. The problem is, I seem to know lots of wrestling facts, and then when I'm. Speaking on here, I tend to get a bit nervous that I'm going to make a mis make a mistake and say the wrong thing. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he won it off Eddie Guerrero on an episode of SmackDown just before Backlash in 2001, and they had to change the matches because Eddie Guerrero already had a match. I think, if I remember rightly. I think maybe Raven was going to challenge for the title and then they put Raven against Rhino for the hardcore title. That's an awesome match if you go back and watch Backlash 2001. Raven versus Rhino in a hardcore match. Basically doing everything they would have done in ECW but for the hardcore title. And everyone remembers the shopping cart part. Yeah, probably... I would say both of their best matches in the WWE, Raven and Rhino. I don't know why I keep looking at the ref, but I do. Let's go, Billy. Hitting a lot of DDTs. Come on, Billy. Do something else. Come on. So I don't know why I didn't get a, an Intercontinental title shot. I mean, Billy was the Intercontinental champion around this time and then lost it to... Chris Benoit. Let's charge a controller. 
How's he gonna win that singles match? What a fighting spirit! What so many reversals. Beautiful. He's unstoppable! Let's go, Billy. Big atomic drop. Super atomic drop. Thanks, Taz. Oh, Jackhammer. Yeah, I used to love... Oh, that could be it. Watch out. Used to love when Billy used to do the Jackhammer when WCW was still in business, just to stick it to Goldberg. Be like how Matt Riddle does it now. This singles match will be Sorry if you guys love Goldberg, but I think very, very overrated. Just loves the cash. All right, come on, Billy. I wonder if he's got that one and only finish that he did from behind. It was kind of like a... A slam from behind. I know he's got the famous. Uh, let's try and hit the one and only. He really is a nice let's slide through. Oh, Matt. What is he gonna do from behind? That's it. That's it. Oh no, he's not behind. Who will be the winner? All right, let's slide. Hurry, hurry. Oh no. Yeah, that's it. That's it. That's it. Oh, he doesn't have it. Doesn't have it. Might just be the famous. All right, let's hit the famous. -er. One, two, three. European champion Billy Gunn. Gosh, ouch. I can't believe that's all. Billy Gunn is your European champion, and that's that should be the whole storyline. The World Wrestling Federation European Champion Billy Gunn. Hey, there's Billy. I really like the design of the European title. Billy Gunn finally wins the European title after wanting it earlier that same night. There's our new champ. I don't think he gets to defend it at all. You just have to select him again. That's it for the story, guys. Stay tuned. Well, at least that helps me get through another character fairly quickly. And stay tuned for more Just Bring It story mode. I wonder what I got. I'll save it later. I'll show you what I got, and then it'll be the end. What card did I get to unlock? Ooh, moves. Fantastic. All right, click the next video. This is Crab Man Gaming here. Throw in a like if you liked this awesome story mode. See you soon.